Yo, what's going on everybody? Suro here. Welcome back to the channel. Man, today at Dream Light Valley just dropped some huge news on us and I still can't tell if it's an April Fool's joke just yet or what it even is. I haven't looked at it fully, so we're going to look at it together. If you guys do enjoy this video at all, please be sure to hit that like button, subscribe to the channel. Only like 62% of people are actually subscribed. These are people that actually watch my content daily. So double check, make sure you've hit that big red button and let's check out Scrooge's shop and then take a look at this news all right let's see what we get today we got Gaston's chair a little table this um oh my gosh it's not looking good it is not looking good oh is this a wally eyed it is the automated parasol definitely picking that up I actually forgot that was even in the game let's see got this got the window another cupboard every day is a cupboard right here and then in the middle we have oh of course i get that i already had that uh i think someone gave it to me actually and we got the fruit stand okay we have some really good stuff over here um new wallpapers and a new floor all right, let me go ahead and grab these real quick. Okay, so here it is. They said, with the arrival of spring, keep the cool times going with a fabulous frosty figure. We're excited to announce Olaf's snow sculpture and Porium arriving in our next update. So as you all know, today is April Fool's Day, but I do not believe they would go through the time to make this and hype everyone up only to disappoint us. So... I'm thinking that their joke was the way they worded this because they have it in all caps. So they kind of worded it like it's Olaf Snow Sculpture Emporium. I don't think that's actually what it is. I do think this is a premium shop item that is coming to the game. And I don't think, I guess they're kind of, the way they word it, they're like expressing like it's something we're going to be able to do. Kind of like um, Beast's Greenhouse or something. But I think it's just like a standard building that you're going to be able to place down. So it does look really cool. This is what it looks like up close. So we have some snowmen in the window. We have a nice little building. Uh, it does have Olaf on the banner. I guess we'll have to read through the comments and see what everyone's been saying. So we got Nora here that says, I hate that today's April Fool's Day because I want this to be real and I hope that it is. People said today's date gives me trust issues. <laughs> you guys will have to let me know. Is this like the legit thing or what's going on? Someone said, I love the shape of this building, even if it's a joke. Repurpose it for something else, please. Someone said no jokes, though it would be super cool to see Minnie's boutique and other things like that having more than just a Scrooge's shop. So yeah, I don't think it's like a shop or a vendor or a stall or anything like that, but I do think it's like a premium shop house that they're showing off. Uh, wait, is this a new house skin or something? When is the next update? Yeah, the next update they should announce here in a couple weeks, but I think it's going to be around at the end of this month. So it's going to be around, I think June 23rd is what we decided it was probably going to be. Uh, Teddy said this building should repurpose for something could look great for Tiana's restaurant with her meals displayed in the window. Hold up now. Teddy may be onto something. That is actually a really, really great idea. Someone said, so this is a bad April Fool's joke seeing as we've been waiting for some kind of new shop to come to the game. Thanks Game Law for showing what sick humor <laughs> looks like. Uh, I don't think it's that deep, especially on April Fool's Day. I mean, I truly believe it is a premium house, like skin or a, a new building or something. But yeah, I don't think it's going to be interactable in any way at all. I know this snow sculptures thing is a joke, but this building still better be added to the game because it is beautiful. 100%. They're not going to develop it and make that image just for that. But it looks really freaking cool. So let me know what you guys think. Also, I did finish both of my dream snaps last night. And I want to share it with you. So if you guys made it to the end of this video, congratulations. You get to see what my submissions are. So this one right here is my first submission. I actually think I'm going to slightly change it because I'm starting to think I may actually enjoy my second submission a little bit better. But with this one, I went with the whole sword vibe. I know a lot of people have been going for that this week. So I decided to do a similar theme and then just completely change the whole background and everything. And I came up with this, got the lighting on my character, built it around with some of these uh, trees that I just don't see people use too often. 
So I thought that was really cool. And then this right here was my submission for my second account. And I had like no items. And that usually be, that's like the problem I run into a lot. But I was still able to pull something through that I think looks pretty decent. And uh, I'm quite happy with it with the lighting, the fire on the bottom, and the little like gold. And this filter just looks really beautiful with all these items. These new Hercule items are just so incredible. I am literally obsessed with them. It's like a completely different vibe of items that we've gotten before. And uh, there's just so many different styles. So if we could get more items like this or like the whole Greek mythology and everything, I would be super happy. Uh, these few items right here actually make me more excited for when hercules is coming to the valley which who knows when that's going to be probably another year or two but it's just it's really cool really cool items Alrighty, let's do a little bit of voting this week man this voting i'm not i'm not gonna lie it's been rough <laughs> this week has been rough but right off the bat we have an insanely amazing submission this is what i love to see they got some summer flowers they got winter background. Their character is summer and winter. Love this. Almost the same outfit that I had on, actually. The, the shoes are different, but that's about it. Oh, and then the shirt. This is beautiful. I love this one. This one, uh, I'm not really getting any winter vibes, so we got to vote for that one. Let's see. Oh, here we go. All right. Maybe it was just my first voting batch that was really rough because we're getting some really good ones. So we have like the skirt, uh, definitely summer hair and everything, winter outfit. Also, the winter summer is definitely shining through on this one. Yeah, this one is really incredible. Um, This one's raining. This one, they do have the pants on. It's an outfit challenge. So they have like the little shorts. So it's summer and winter. Okay, these are both really cute too. I like how they have like mostly a winter outfit, but then the background is a lot more summer. And then they do have some summer aspects to their outfit. This one, since it's an outfit challenge, I'm not really seeing too much of, you know, the summer winter vibes, mainly all winter. So we'll vote for this one over here. Okay, they have like a little dress and also a scarf on here. So I think they nailed that one. That one's pretty good. We'll vote for it. Oh, wow. Okay, so this one is like a winter dress. I'm not seeing much summer. I think for the outfit, we're gonna have to go with this one, but the background on this one is really beautiful. So we'll go with that. <laughs> it's kind of just a random spa pet drop down here. They're like, there's your summer. I'll give them a vote for it though. They tried. All right, a similar like size of photos. This one looks like it's in like a realm. They do have a lot of winter stuff with some shorts on. I actually kind of like this. I do like Skull Rock back here too though, but I think I got to go with that one. Um, oh, this is actually a really cute angle. They have like the ice thing and then they have a picnic area set up. The outfit, they got some warm clothes and some clothes for, you know, when it's colder. And then uh, we'll just vote for this. We'll vote for this. Let's do 10 more. We got one, um, two, lots of new players in here. Three, <laughs> they got the armor on. I've been using this for my dream step and I'm actually really in love with it. If you can get the right back piece and head and the hair and everything, it can actually look really good. And we'll just do four more. Oh, they have a mustache on here. Okay, this person selected Wally's garden. That's an interesting backdrop. They do have a hoodie on and some shorts. And we'll do two more. We'll do one and our last one. Oh, this is too cute. Not much win Oh, I guess they do have the scarf and the beanie. Okay, we'll vote for that one. Alrighty, guys. Thank you so much for watching the video. Hope you guys have the best day ever. And I'll see you in the next one.